All right, for the first one of the series, the band pec stretch, all right, you're gonna place your hand inside of a band. Make sure the band is up high, all right? If you're taller than about six foot, I would just tie it to the top of the rack, all right? After my wrist is in, I'm just gonna grab over here. So I have this kind of grab. I'm gonna step forward with the exact same foot. Keep the hand up high. We wanna to try to maintain at least like 110 degrees here. Once I have tension on that pec and I can feel a slight pec stretch here, I'm gonna just rotate my palm down. It should feel a nice pec, pec minor stretch. All right, and you'll do that for the prescribed reps. The next one is a lat stretch. So I'll put my elbow inside, all right? Hand grabs on the outside. I wanna to try to keep my bicep by my ear. For this one, we wanna step forward with the opposite foot, all right? I like to put my hand on my rib cage and make sure I'm not flare, uh, going into an extension. And then I'm gonna pulse forward with the knee, all right? Important to pulse through the knee and not try to pulse through the upper half because I wanna relax the shoulder, all right? Get a nice passive stretch here. All right, the last one is a foam roller snow angel. So we need a longer foam roller. I'm gonna have a seat on it, tailbone at the end. Important cue here, we wanna make sure that the entire spine stays flat on this foam roller. So I don't wanna be in extension. So I wanna get that whole spine flat once I have that. Now I'm gonna make a snow angel. As I'm doing that, keep the spine flat. So I don't wanna do this. I wanna keep that spine flat, and then I'm gonna let my hands roll, and then go through my snow angel pattern. 